Welcome to another weekly round of boys and girls. Now then, let me tell you, this week and this weekend has been awesome. It's been the best. It literally has been the best. It has been what I want all my weeks and weekends to be like. It's been busy, it's been productive, it's been, the weather has been beautiful and it's just been awesome. Now, it is dark and I'm using my light which is why you can pretty much only just see my face and nothing else, so I'm like a floating head. <laughs> but, um, yeah, such a busy day today that I've only just got round to filming this. So, I promise you I am here, if you're wondering why it's so dark, but the my bedroom light wouldn't have looked good on this. So, to round up the week, what have we done this week? We have done lots of things. Um, we've achieved my we've achieved the goals that i set out to do and more believe me um the main goals that we set out to do we got to manchester we went to manchester check out the digital garage in the um, google space did that do a photo shoot done three photo shoots this week done more, pff, we've exceeded we have exceeded goals this week so we managed to do all three of them in manchester um the other one i said was Meet someone that I've been talking to on Twitter, but that didn't work out, which is fine. There's more time for that. Um, but yeah, this week, oh, this week has been awesome. And I just want to say, right, the reason why this is so is going up so late today is because I've been to two places for a photo shoot today. One of them wasn't so good because there wasn't really like the light was going. Um, the just where we were it was at a, um, a canal but I couldn't like you know when you just you can't see what you want to capture in your mind any photographers out there will understand what I mean you know when you just you're walking up and down the spot trying to scope it out and you just can't see what's what it was like that so <clears throat> anyway from where it was um, to get back home to where I live you can drive through Huddersfield now, my mum was like, can we drive through Huddersfield instead of going back the way we came? So my dad was like, yeah, yeah, why not? So we drove through Huddersfield, right? And we turned up this road, and I can't remember what the park is called. But, bro, let me tell you. We turned up this road, and the sunset was coming through the war memorial in this park. And, oh, my days, it was beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So we've, I said, we're going to have to stop, you know, because at first I was like, oh, I'm going to have to keep this place in mind and come back for a photo shoot. But then I thought, it's a perfect place for a sunset. Like, the sun was setting through the war memorial, right? Mm. Excuse me. And this war memorial was massive, honestly. So big. And it was... Just follow me photography Instagram and you'll see it, honestly. Link will be in the description for that. You'll see what I mean by it. It's so big. And it stood proud at the bottom of this... Um, park not garden but he stood proud at the bottom of his park and the sun was coming through it and i was like oh we have to stop so i was like dad can we stop just for a minute just while i go and get some some pictures so we pulled over we turned around pulled over um went into the park and all oh my days best decision of my life best decision of my life to uh to stop and go and take um take some pictures oh man honestly such a beautiful place if you live in Huddersfield you'll know what the park is that I'm talking about um, it was called something like Greenhead Park or something but oh man absolutely gorgeous and this war memorial right it was for the first world war and the second world war and they had this big standing stone with the big pillar and a cross on the top and it had a load of um, wreaths of roses at the bottom but it had like this pit, this curve curvature of pillars around the, the around the outside. Oh, I've never seen anything like it. Honestly, it looked like something. The park, it's in general, right, was very Victorian esque, and it looked something straight out of Mary Poppins. Now, like I said, follow me photography Instagram. I'll put it in the link, and you'll be able to see what I mean because it was absolutely stunning, absolutely stunning. Honestly, so this week. <laughs> I've gone out of the house, I've achieved my goals and more. Saturday, we went and did a photo shoot. Uh, went out and did a photo shoot. The rest of those pictures will be on my photography Instagram. I'm literally, I took so many that I'm slowly working my way through. So, we did that yesterday. 
today went to two places the first place wasn't that successful but the second place phew, absolutely blew my mind honestly so i guess you could say if you've got like if you see something and you've got an instinct act upon it because i, I tell you what if i'd have drove away from there today and not done a photo shoot and got the pictures that i got i would have regretted it so just if you get that inkling to just like, you know, I, I want, let's, why not do that? Do it. Just do it. If you're walking past something you think I fancy that, do it. If you're driving past something and you see something that looks nice and you're like, I want to go there. If you've got time, do it. Just act upon those instincts. Because I tell you what, there's no better feeling than acting upon those instincts and just achieving what you envisioned it up here. Because, oh, honestly... That park is absolutely stunning, absolutely stunning. And with the weather that we've been having recently, clear skies and sunshine, speechless, mate, honestly, absolutely speechless. So like I say, follow me for photography Instagram, which will be in the description box below, and you'll be able to see some of the pictures that I got today because I managed to use my, my photography orb thing. So nice, so nice. So... That's that's kind of this week's roundup. Um, sorry it's late, but like I said, more weeks like this, please, and more weekends like this, and I'll be loving life. It's fine. This Honestly, this week has been perfect. It couldn't have been any better. Couldn't have been any better. And this weekend was full of activities, full of things that we did, and it was just absolutely pucker. So, <clears throat> I'm going to love you and uh, leave you. Can't get my words out. I'm going to love you and leave you with a short one today. Because I need to get this up on the channel and I need to still eat because I've not had food yet. I still need to do that. So, like I say, for like the fifth time, photography Instagram will be in the description box below. And you can check out some of the pictures that I'll be uploading in the next coming days. Because like I say, I've got a lot to work through. All the social links, like my Twitter and my other Instagram, will be in the description box below. As well as my Snapchat, if you're on Snapchat. Feel free to hit that subscribe button. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye!